Suddenly and inevitably, Fry's is now closed. <laughs> Gadget Martian here. I'm in front of Fry's Electronics, San Jose, California, corporate store, and it finally happened. Fry's Electronics has finally ceased operations. Today is Monday, March 1st, 2021, and as you can see, the signs out at the street corners are covered, and there's nobody here working. The parking lot is empty, except for these abandoned cars. And as you can see, there's actually most of the parking, or a big chunk of the parking is fenced off. So it finally happened. We knew it was coming. Today, it's finally here. If the corporate headquarters is closed, you can pretty much be assured that all the other locations are also closed. <laughs> a week before Christmas 2020 to see if there are still items in the store here for stocking stuffers and items that you can add to your shopping list. Let's go in and check it out. A few months ago when I was here, they pretty much had little to no TVs. At least now they have a couple here on display. These TVs are generic TVs, none of the name brands. And a good portion of the TV section is appliances what what appliances are left here at the store but pretty much behind me it's all blocked off from this structure right here the old um, theater is pretty much blocked off from that portion on and as you can see what was once thriving with so many various selections and tvs and various other video type of devices it's now a portion of the store that was moved from the other section where all the towers are, the PC towers. And if you can see behind me, they've also put all the chairs here, all the gaming chairs. And then of course, over there is all uh, storage and uh, empty space. So it's just getting smaller and smaller. It looks like they're really, really consolidating to make everything look like they have so much more products here, so many more uh, items here to sell. They just have them all uh, blocked off and congregated. What was once a cool place to be here at the movie theater behind me is all blocked off now. Covered with these uh, actually name brand Samsung TVs. They don't have these on display. I didn't see them at least, but at least they're in the box ready to go. So since the last time I was here, they actually do have a couple of name brand TVs. But everything, like I mentioned, is very consolidated now. With just a week before Christmas, back in the past, the better days of fries, you would see these places filled with customers and people trying to buy stuff. Look at the section here, the Christmas section, lights and toys and everything. This place is all empty. And literally, we're about a week away from Christmas. Not the usual thriving situation that we once saw here at Fry's during its heyday. There's about maybe five or six customers in the store. Probably the same amount of employees. Nowhere to be found. If you've ever been to the Fry's Brokaw location, behind me right here is kind of midway through the store. Um, you, you see like, I think they had a, a lot of like videos and DVDs and all that kind of stuff over here. This is kind of the section where the DVDs used to be and it's kind of almost in the middle of the store you see the uh, PC repair computer repair behind me that's pretty much where the store ends now 
the whole area where all the computers were and all the hard drives and all the motherboards and everything are all gone. As you can see here, this is where it used to be. There's where the computers were, all the PCs. And this is only half a store now, the cafe. It's only half a store. So you see here, you do have some Christmas items. And now where the PCs are, they're all gone. Very interesting. Surprisingly, there are a number of different PC games available and PC programs here. So the store is actually, this item, or this, this aisle is actually filled with a lot of PC games. Go figure. One of the few aisles in the whole store that would be good for Christmas actually is the little accessories, the little stocking stuffers that you find in this aisle. And then also, you know, you got a couple of steering wheels here, a couple game controllers here. You got Neo Geo. I'm pretty sure this is a fairly uh, modern uh, gift that you can give somebody. And then of course, behind my other shoulder here is the PS, PlayStation and Xbox section. Very small amount of merchandise here. As I keep going here, for those who still use PC type programs, you have all of, you know, your traditional financial 365 director's cut. Back in the day, I'd always come to Fry's to get all the latest video editing type software. And it's still actually here. Nowadays, a lot of people don't do this. They do everything online. They don't actually buy a physical CD because if you buy a copy, a DVD or CD, most likely you're gonna to have to update it on the internet anyway. So it's easier just to get it, get a download. But uh, for those who still like getting these programs literally off the shelf and putting them in their computer, they still have all these available for you. Not as much as it used to be, just one section. One section of games, one section of computer uh, software, and of course, one section of DVDs. And I think the last DVDs that'll probably be remaining here to purchase, of course, are the adult DVDs, always popular with a lot of people. But as you can see behind me, this is pretty much it with all the DVDs. There's maybe another uh, a row maybe over here that has maybe half a row of DVDs, but for the most part, this is it. And as you can see, this is where the store ends. From the DVD section, it's literally cut in half now. I'm sure the next couple of months, it's even going to be smaller and smaller and smaller. And it'll be interesting to figure out what they, in fact, actually do at the end with this whole property. You can still find miscellaneous stuff, a couple of drones. You have your uh, power supplies here, just random stuff, battery chargers, all kinds of just various miscellaneous stuff that you might need. Just stuff that you might not find in say Best Buy or another uh, store. So it's actually good. They still have this kind of stuff often 
you'd go to Fry's for just miscellaneous type of stuff like this when you're trying to set up your home uh, entertainment system. Wires, cabling, all that kind of stuff. Everything is now consolidated, so it's easier to find. So I guess the good thing about it is, even though it's a lot smaller, half the store, all the items are all filled with the shelf. So they've kind of grown into themselves. The store is not bigger than the products that they have on the shelf. So the inventory in the store is a good size right now. Unfortunately, you're not getting all the selection that you had before, but that's just a sign of our times. miss the Aztec and the Mayan theme here at this store along with all the other themes at all the other stores all the special themes from 50s sci-fi to Alice in Wonderland to all that kind of stuff as you can see right here they still have the social distancing pandemic situation going here which is understandable here we are. No more Fry's Electronics. I'm sure they're, they've sent all the inventory back to whoever owned it. They're not even doing a liquidation sale, a closing the store sale of all items. This must mean that they were pretty much Oh look, the shopping carts are still here. So quiet here in San Jose, California at the corporate store, the main store out of all the chains. So quiet here. Half the parking lot, all fenced off. It's just sad to see the sight, but it was inevitable that this was going to happen. After 36 years, the day is finally here. Bye, fries. How symbolic for the flags at half staff to commemorate the unfortunate situation of Fry's Electronics being closed. As you can see, I'm in front of the world corporate headquarters. In back of these world corporate headquarters is the corporate store, the main store of Fry's Electronics. And it's completely closed and empty can't even have access to the inside of the corporate office here but it is just an unfortunate situation that after 36 years Fry's Electronics has ceased existence